For a long time, Linux distribution has been considered as a complicated, non-user friendly operating system only for advanced users with great emphasis on command line interaction, having no GUI desktop or at most a poorly built and ugly desktop environment. However, this trend has been changing from past few years. Desktop environments like GNOME, KDE, XFC has been around for a long time, but the new modern and young desktops like Solus Budgie and Elementary's Pantheon is providing the much needed freshness and taking on the competition with the likes of Windows and Mac OS X. And in my opinion, the leader in this list is the Dippin desktop environment from Dippin OS. I think it's visually very appealing, looks beautiful and if you have watched my previous video, you probably know that I'm a big fan. But it's not just the eye candy looks, the distro is also very functional. It has a good mixture of default application, so Chrome, Spotify, Crossover, all comes pre-installed and you also have majority of other popular apps available in its stores. So a new release of Dippin always gets me excited. So when Dippin 15.5 was released recently, I quickly downloaded and installed the distro and I've been using it for few days now. And in this video, we'll check out what's new in the latest release of Dippin. And there's been quite a few important changes this time. So let's begin. So this is the default desktop that you get after fresh installation. Visually, it's not very different from the last release, but there has been quite a lot of subtle changes and many minute optimization done. Let me quickly change the dock to efficient mode. I prefer this style of dock. All right, now let's start with the major changes first. All right, first is the support to HIDPI, which stands for high dots per inch. Now this is very helpful for high resolution displays that are smaller in size. For example, displays on a 13 inch or a 15 inch laptop. Nowadays you find many laptops with 4K or QHD displays. However, if you set the display on such high resolution, the entire desktop, the icons and the text becomes extremely small, making it difficult to read or operate. HIDPI allows you to scale the display so that icons and text becomes bigger but as the display is still at higher resolution you get a clear and crisp image with all that high pixel density another change in the display menu is the introduction of night shift mode now this changes the temperature of your screen depending on the time of the day so during night the screen gets a bit warmer making it less stressful to your eyes next is the new hotspot feature in the network menu now this allows you to share your internet connection to other Wi-Fi device via Wi-Fi card on your computer. It is pretty useful feature and generally available on smartphones, but Dippin has put it in their desktop and made it extremely easy to set up and use. Moving on to the next feature, Dippin now also supports fingerprint scanning for unlocking the computer. I was not able to test this feature, but if you have a device with fingerprint scanner, Here's the list of supported device, you can take advantage of this feature. Next is the new application called Dippin Clone. This app lets you clone the entire disk or a partition on a disk to another storage media. It is a very useful app if you want to take a backup of your computer regularly. Dippin has made the entire process a child's play. I have used it a few times and it works pretty well. Another important feature is the support for Flatpak packages. Dippin now support Flatpak which is the latest application distribution system. Nowadays almost all major distribution provide support to Flatpak and Snap packages. So it's good Dippin has also joined the list. If you do not know what is Flatpak, I'll make a separate video on this topic very soon covering it in detail. So stay tuned for that. And other popular features like Dippin App Store which allows you to install or remove a program with just a click has been updated with all the new packages. Dippin Music app now shows you the lyrics of the song that is playing but it's a hit or miss. It do not work all the time. Dippin Movie is a great movie player that supports 4K media and also plays almost all popular video formats. Alright so these were the major changes. As I said there has been a lot of subtle and minute changes and optimization to the desktop like addition of Foursquare option on right click menu. You also have new icon themes that are now available and many other such changes. Alright so that was all. So this is Dippin 15.5, a modern Linux distribution which is aimed for an average computer user. A distribution that is easy to operate, has just the right mix of softwares and above all it looks stunning. If you have never used Dippin OS, I recommend you to give this release a try. 
all right so that was all for today thank you guys for watching this video if you like this video kindly press the like button and if you have any comment suggestion or feedback for my channel please mention that in the comment box below and if you want to see more such videos kindly subscribe to my channel xps tech thank you guys for watching and i'll see you next time